Immerse yourself in the ancient world of Tamil Nadu as we journey back in time to the era of the Pandyas, one of the three ancient Tamil dynasties, a lineage that left an indelible mark on the history of southern India. In the beginning, the Pandyas emerged in the historical narrative around the 4th century BCE, catching the eye of Greek historians and even dispatching ambassadors to Roman emperors. Their initial capital, Korkai, was a bustling seaport situated at the southernmost tip of the Indian peninsula. Later, they shifted their base to what is now known as Madurai, where numerous early Tamil inscriptions of the Pandyas have been unearthed. Fast forward to the 6th century CE, we encounter a pivotal figure in the Pandya lineage, King Kadungon. This ruler, alongside Pallava King Simhavishnu, is credited with ending the Kalabra rule, ushering in a new era in the Tamil-speaking region. His reign, estimated to have spanned from 590 to 620 CE, saw the revival of the Pandya rule in South India. His son, Maravarman Avanisulamani, succeeded him, and the Velvakuti inscription gave us most of our knowledge about these rulers. Religion played a significant role in the Pandya dynasty. Initially followers of Jainism, the Pandyas later embraced Hinduism, specifically Shaivism. Not just religious patrons, they were also known for their patronage of Tamil literature and culture, contributing significantly to the growth of the Tamil language and literature. The political journey of the Pandyas was not a smooth ride. They faced periods of decline and upliftment. After the invasion of the Calabras, they lost their fortune but revived under the rule of Kadungon. The rise of the Cholas again pushed them into obscurity, but they managed to re-establish their kingdom. In conclusion, the Pandya dynasty, with its rich history and cultural contributions, played a significant role in shaping the history of South India. Despite periods of decline and foreign invasions, the Pandyas demonstrated their resilience and strategic prowess. Their legacy continues to influence the cultural and historical landscape of Tamil Nadu a testament to their enduring significance.